29-year-old Clyde Lee Reyes Jr. of Bemidji has been charged with murder in connection to a drug overdose death. A reading from the criminal complaint, quote, on January 2nd, 2022, at approximately 8.30 a.m., agents with the Paul Bunyan Drug Task Force and Sheriff's Investigators responded to 8429 Bermidji Road, Northeast in Beltrami County, to investigate a suspected overdose death. Upon arrival, agents and investigators were directed to a basement apartment in the home by the homeowner, who had rented the downstairs uh, apartment to a relative. Agents and investigators located a 30-year-old, A.J., laying on the floor next to the bed in the bedroom of the apartment. A.J. was unresponsive and did not display vital signs. First responders contacted the funeral home in order to transport uh, A.J. from the premises. Agents and investigators seized a small piece of ripped paper containing a white powder that was a suspected controlled substance. Agents and investigators also seized an improvised ingestion device containing white residue, also indicative of the use of a controlled substance. Agents further seized other items in A.J.'s residence. On January 3rd of 2022, the Midwest uh, Medical Examiner's Office conducted an autopsy and determined AJ's cause of death was due to a fentanyl overdose. Subsequent investigation involved reviewing her Facebook account. Investigation established that on the night of January 1st and early morning hours of uh, January 2nd, AJ was in contact with Clyde Lee Reyes Jr. via Facebook Messenger. During this uh, time period, Paul Bunyan Drug Task Force agents established that A.J. had reached out to uh, Reyes to inquire about obtaining BOI, B-O-I, which is street slang for fentanyl or heroin. Reyes responded that he had BOI for sale. Reyes indicated that he had a dub of fentanyl available. Reyes made arrangements to drive to A.J.'s residence at 8429 Bemidji Road Northeast so she could purchase the BOI. The Facebook Messenger conversation between AJ and Reyes establishes that at approximately 1.30 a.m. on January 2nd, Reyes arrived and delivered the heroin fentanyl to AJ at a residence. At approximately 1.45 a.m. on January 2nd, the Facebook communication by AJ abruptly stopped. On March 7th, uh, the uh, task force director obtained a Mirandized uh, statement from Reyes, who was in custody at the Beltrami County Jail on an unrelated criminal matter. Reyes informed the agent that he indeed sold A.J. heroin fentanyl in the early morning hours of January 2nd, 2022, unquote. Uh, that was directly from the criminal complaint. Reyes is charged with murder, third degree, sell, give, or distribute a controlled substance, carries a maximum sentence of 25 years in prison, and or a $40,000 fine. I'm Neil Carlson reporting for inews.tv.